A flutter ablation procedure is performed as a day case, so you get to go home the same day. It takes about 60 to 90 minutes, and we do it either under heavy sedation or even a full general anaesthetic. The procedure involves having some plastic tubes popped into the vein at the top of the right leg so that we can insert some wires into the top chamber on the right side of the heart. And then we use an electrical current to do the ablation, which allows us to get rid of abnormal electrical signals and get the heart back into a normal rhythm. The important thing to understand is that the effect of the ablation is instantaneous and you will go home with your heart in a normal rhythm. The success rate from a flutter ablation procedure is in excess of 95%, so fewer than 5% of individuals will come back for a second procedure six to 12 months later. The vast majority of our patients will not have any further problems. It is a very low risk ablation procedure and the risk of any serious complications, such as a stroke or bleeding around the sac uh, around the heart, is less than one in 100 cases. I therefore think that the atrial flutter is, uh, ablation is a good procedure. And since the effect is instantaneous, within a matter of days after the ablation, the symptoms of palpitations and inappropriate breathlessness that you may be feeling should start to get better.